How's it going YouTube? Pastor Sis here back with part two on release day of 2020-21 Topps Chrome UEFA Champions League product. Uh, if you saw the other video, we opened up three boxes and I was trying to kind of slow play through it. I want to enjoy the product, but I also kind of want to get videos out of a full case so people can kind of expect what they're uh, what they're going to get. But honestly, this stuff is just loaded with rookies. Tops just really, really loaded this up with rookies. It just really depends on, you know, are any of these guys going to pan out or not? Um, and really, that's that's kind of the question with this. Uh, talked about. I'll hit on it probably in every video, but you know, that's the kind of the question mark with this this year. There's no really guy that just you know just like really just exciting people. I think. Um, like Holland did last year and Mbappe has and stuff like that. But I think there's guys in here that could just be staple, solid players for years to come. Um, you know, guys like Jude Bellingham. Obviously, if you're, a, if you're an English footballer, that kind of gives you a little bit of a plus right there. It gives you a little bump. It's kind of like uh, the English F1 racers. They automatically, guys like Lando Norris and, um, you know, George Russell and obviously Lewis Hamilton – because they're English, I think they get a little bit of a bump. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. Nice way to start out with a Lionel Messi um, and Kevin De Bruyne. Two superstars right there. Tillman, rookie, and nice. Ronaldo Refractor, first pack. So we got the Ronaldo Refractor out of the way. We're going we're gonna to stick that up on the wall. So doing pretty decently with the Refractors. I think my goal out of a... Uh, out of this year and I, I mentioned it last time is like I just want to pull Mbappe color <laughs> I think I pulled one like really really late last year after opening like three cases of uh, 2019-20 so you know it is what it is um, but we got an orange I think in this one there's a Mason Mount and orange is gonna be oh it's an autograph is it me or is it like every first pack I open up has the uh, has the auto and it's uh, Noah Lang from Club, Club Bruges. Don't know too much about him, uh, to be honest. But, hey, he's a forward. Um, it just sounds familiar to me, but we'll put that over there. I have, like, my stacks of things everywhere to go over everything at the end of the at the end of the case break. Got a stack of rookies over here. Nice refractors and color over here, which is a little bit low right now. So, hopefully, we get some, some better stuff. Uh, we got... Nice speckle of uh, Mason Mount and Phil Foden, future stars, which that's really nice that he's in here twice. I mean, obviously, you know, first chrome, first prism is kind of a thing to a lot of collectors. Um, a lot of people are big on Mason Mount, so we're gonna we're gonna put that in the good hit um, category that we can review. So we'll kind of see, as I as I said in the first video, well, you know, I got these early, pre-ordered them at about $3,500 a case. Um, and also I've said, you know, I'm, I'm, it's hard for me to hold sealed product, but uh, I might not be cracking open the second case. Got another Mason uh, Greenwood, first chrome, and a purple is going to be a rookie. So that's pretty nice. Of, nice, Rainier Jesus. Which again, I don't know too much about him. I know he's on loan to Borussia Dortmund from Real Madrid, so I might be saying his name wrong. Let's see if there's the edge problem. Might be a uh, hard to say. I think there's just a little bit of one, but that's uh, 170 out of 250. And I was going through stuff uh, so fast last time that um, I was even forgetting to like. I was kind of just saying, hey, this is a 250, but not. Not like really going into depth, but you know, we actually went 30 some minutes in the other one, uh, which is one of the longest videos I've ever had. I don't get this at all. Tete rookie card that does not make sense to me, tops. I don't know why you did that. Um, same picture as last year, too. Lazy, just lazy. Nice Phil Foden refractor. That's a very nice hit. Um, I think a lot of people will want that. A lot of people big on him. Obviously playing in the Euros a little bit. I think I think the Euros are really going to um, drive some of this stuff up maybe soon. A lot of these younger guys. Unfortunately, like Kamavinga, I don't think is playing for France. 
I don't know if Jamal Musiala, if I'm saying that right, is playing for Germany. But I know Jude is playing for England. Foden's there. So, you know, guys like that could see a bump. We got a speckle of Uber Eats. Just kidding. Uh, Luis Enrique. All right. Oh, come on, man. This is just... Uh, Have yet to pull a base card of Dominic Saja Balaski or whatever his name is, um, which is odd in three boxes so far. I really want to, a lot of people are going big on him. So, well, there's a Red Bull guy, but not the guy we want. Kareem Adeyemi, is that it? Nice refractor. The refractors in this are really nice. They really are. They're some of the nicer looking refractors I've seen. I, I'd almost have to get the... Uh, the of a fractor of each one of the releases so far and kind of compare them but it just like really shines it's like really really silver um jesus again nice rookie uh brandon williams and a green in this one is gonna be uh raheem sterling is that a green bubbles yeah it's a green bubbles i guess that it's like a lime green kind of looking thing so Still like to hit a nice, uh, nice rookie parallel of something other than a refractor. But hey, we'll take what we can. It looks like a gold in this one, or yellow maybe. I think those are the 2.99 Hichi Wang, and that's not a bad one there. Liverpool, uh, Nico Williams, defender to 2.99. I know a lot of people are like. That's the thing in products like this. It's if it's EPL. It's going to have value to somebody typically because there's just so many people that are EPL fans. There's a Fatih, second year card, but really nice. And Billy Gilmore, rookie. Haven't really seen him play too much, but we'll see if we're good things. And then we got a Holland um, for Borussia Dortmund, Future Stars, which I don't mind them putting that in there so much just because they didn't do that last year for him. But... You know, if they put him in as a future stars next year, it's going to be like, okay, really? You're doing like a Pulisic thing here where he's a future star every year. I don't think Pulisic was a future star every year, but he was a future star in 2017, I think 18 products. So there we got uh, Kai Havertz, um, a rookie and rookie of Lucas. I can't hardly see that. Might need to change my contacts out. Goodness gracious. This is like, it's some small lettering, like really small. So it's certain things I might miss in this. I know there's nice Mukoku rookie. I think that's the second one we've hit. So that's nice. I always get uh, interrupted mid sentence as I'm talking and trying to open at the same time. So like whatever. Okay. Uh, we got uh, Wesley Schneider um, with him in the, uh, him in the, uh, who is that? There's a Juventus guy that's like from way, way, way far back. So like, I, don't under, I really don't understand those, but like you couldn't find two other base guys in the Champions League to put in this. Okay. Um, we got, not sure. It looks like we got a purple in this. Yeah. Alessandro DePiro. I don't think he's purple is going to be, oh, Jaden. Come on, man. It's a 250. I like that, but we've already got we already got a pink of him. Like there's so many other Dortmund players I would rather have. Like just about every one of them. But unfortunately, two Jaden ones. I mean, I'm a big fan of his, but come on, man. All right, there's Arena. It's pretty nice. Because he's USA, because he's American, he's automatically going to have value. Yeah, this guy was born in 74. He's not playing anymore. I don't know what he's doing in there. Um, we got maybe a gold in this. Uh, there's a Ronaldo. And I think it's an insert. Joshua Xerxy to 50. So I don't know. I've not seen him play much. So I don't really know much about him. But uh, we'll go ahead and sleeve it up. As it is to 50, but you know. 
All right, we got, uh, okay, first time seeing him, actually, Conrad De La Fuente. And I think this guy is actually American. Yeah, he's American, so definitely uh, sleeve that up. Might be good. That, again, is going to give him probably a little bit of bump and Kai Havertz Refractor, which will also. Uh... Now, last year, Kai was in uh, Byron Leverkusen, right? So would that be his first Chelsea Chrome? I don't know. I mean, again, you know, I don't put a lot of value in that, but a lot of people do. So a lot of Chelsea fans, especially after them winning the Champions League. So, you know, grats to them. They beat my team in the semifinal. There's another Ansu Fati. Uh, that is a Future Stars. Two more packs to go. Goodness gracious, we are like 10 minutes to go through a box. I'm really taking my time with this. All right, uh, Valverde, which I still think should have got the rookie card, even though you know he's been playing for a few years, but I don't know of any other cards. And then we got Golazo, Holland, very nice. Um, I don't know. I have not seen very many of these, only a few, so this might be actually kind of a hard hit. So I think, I think I've seen one for Messi and one for Ronaldo, so they might be like one per box or something like that. So, But we'll put it up there. It's a pretty looking card really nice really happy with the uh with these cards their uh stock is really nice i said it in the last video but they remind me of chrome match attacks uh Firmino and jeremy doku we seem to be getting all the parallels of like guys that the team's right you know like we get jeremy doku but we don't get the refractor of uh kamavinga which is fine you know can't win them all, right? All right, we're going to get into box number two for this break, but box number five for everything. I'd really like to hit a super fractor this year. I mean, wouldn't everybody, but I've never hit a super fractor in Topps Chrome. I think the lowest I've ever hit is probably to five. Um, I actually hit a a super fractor in F1 and have never hit one in here. And like, I've only ever opened up seven boxes of that. It was a super fractor, but it wasn't actually a one of one. Um, so that was kind of interesting. Tops hasn't done that as far as I know. Valverde ref uh, refractor, very nice. Really solid midfielder. Um, had some injury problems this year, but Real Madrid just so stacked in the midfield. It's hard to get on that starting, uh, starting to line up anyway but they were just racked with injuries this year yes i'm making excuses oh there he is okay uh Sizaba Z i'm sorry i'm just gonna call him dominic but you know a lot of people are really big on him midfielder hungarian uh went from salzburg to um leipzig i guess and uh so people are really expecting a lot of good things about him a lot of people are big on him and we got Zhao Felix, Future Stars, on the back. So that was nice. It was like three boxes. And unless I missed him somewhere because of my eyesight, goodness gracious, this, this the words are so small, it's ridiculous. All right. And Refractor is going to be Florian Nehaus. Okay. All right. But you never know with this. I mean, Topps just loaded this with rookies so much that there could be somebody that, you know, nobody really thinks of. This is like my fourth base drink cow. I'm saying that right again. But uh, Raheem Sterling. So, you know, it is what it is. And, ooh, it's a gold autograph of um, Taylor from Ajax. 32 of 50. I like the look of the... Uh, the color parallels they're really nice and i don't see any edge wear on that one actually so that's good too the um the autos are are quite thick stock we always seem to be getting the autograph like really early in the uh in the box i hope i really hope these boxes aren't um uh mapped where the autograph's always in the same spot that would be disastrous uh, don't buy packs at uh, stores if so. Billy Goldmore. There's another Ronaldo. Man, he's all over the place. And there we go. Henier Jesus. Maybe that's how you say it. I, there's many ways to say that one. You could say Rainer, Jesus, Renier. Like, I don't know. I'd have to hear somebody say him like a, uh, 
like a broadcast or something like that. Like after you watch the game that he's playing in, hear the hear the broadcaster say it, and then know, okay, that's how you say it. <laughs> I learn a lot that way. Brandon Williams, and even then, you think they're like I guess they probably speckle. Um, I guess they would probably like before the games. Like, okay, how do you say this guy's name? How do you say this guy's name? Okay, got it. Good to go. There's a Jude rookie. Very nice. Then we got uh, Kai Havertz. And on the back is going to be Reese James, Future Stars. I don't recall if he's in the um, if he's in the base set or not. I can't not remember, but I know we have not hit one. That's like the third or fourth uh, Bellingham. So that's pretty good. Not bad. Young kid, solid player. Maybe not a big goal scorer, but, you know, maybe he's going to have some value there. Uh, we got Pedri, who, you know, plays for Barcelona, so obviously I'm not going to root for him. But, hey, Phil Foden, is there some print lines there? Or I guess it's more the design. It's like there's a line, 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 line. I wonder if that's supposed to be like that. Is that on another speckle? Yeah, it is. It's actually the design. Interesting. Like, at first I thought it was like two giant print lines, but it's actually the design of the card is like that. So, very cool. All right, we got Donnie Vanderbeek. All right. And Virgil van Dyke, Refractor. Which we're going to go ahead and I, I really like sleeving up like all the refractors and everything of anybody that I view as a star, you know, and uh, I don't mind wasting a penny sleeve on them. There's a Holland. And we got a pink on the back. And Mbappe got the two two big guys right there, two prospects. This is a purple, it's a or a pink, it's a rookie, and it is Kenneth Taylor. Um, and that's to 175 and those are that's a new um, a new parallel this year the pink speckle or something I haven't even really tried to um, tried to read the uh, the pack it's just crazy there's so many in this I think somebody worked out like 4200 cases and they don't know if there's going to be retail of this, but supposedly there are retail SKUs, so I don't know. There's another Messi. Always happy to have those. Sorry if the cards were uh, not in the camera view. I was kind of not watching there for a second. And then uh, this guy again is a refractor, really? Come on, man. Back-to-back -back packs. That's one that you, like, you complain about unless it's like obviously one of the big guys you know that you want uh but you know didn't work out for us there like last year there's jamal nice and okay eric garcia purple carbon manchester city guy but yeah if it works out for you it's like last year i don't know if anybody remembers but i was opening up tops chrome and i was getting these uh i had a few boxes that it was like the second card or actually the first card was a duplicate of the third card. So it kind of sucked. But then when I hit like a Fatih and got two Fatih rookies in the same pack, I was like, okay, it's not so bad. It's only bad if you, hey, that's the first Sergio Ramos. Nice. It's only bad if you don't hit good people, right? Uh, here's a yellow and man, been hitting a lot of these guys um, from Marseille. To 299, 278 of 299. That's another one, I think. That wow, that's a so they added a two to 299 parallel, they added a 175 parallel before it was what 250, um, 150, 99, 50, 25, 10, 5. I can't remember. They've added uh, added a few every year, it seems. So, but we've got Leroy Sané and another good lazel of Lataro Martinez. So, yeah, those seem to be about one per uh, one per box with those. So, not too rare. And I don't think it's numbered. It is not. I 
saw the name. So hopefully this is something good. We got Jaden. And yeah, something finally. Jude Bellingham or Fractor. Gorgeous. Okay, nice. I feel a little bit better now. I mean, hey, I'm I'm kind of happy. The fact, if I paid seven thousand dollars for this case, I might be a little bit upset. But um, you know, we still got plenty of boxes to go. I think we're gonna do just fine with this. But hey, the the whole thing for me is to get some nice base rookies and just sit and enjoy watch opening up some product. I haven't. I feel like I haven't opened up soccer in so long. It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. I just. I, I feel like this year none of the product based on their, based on the box prices, it just was not worth it to me at all. Um, so and on the back. Oh wow. So I guess those can be two per box. Galazzo, um, Holland. So I guess got two of those. All right. One of the reasons why I bought into a break and got Dortmund in like six boxers for like two hundred dollars. You get Holland, Reyna, Jesus. I mean, you don't get Bellingham or Makaku, but you know Holland's got value even as a secondary card, which is interesting to me about this. Uh, let's get Sadio De Piero, uh, Refractor. Yeah, which is interesting to me about this product is uh, well, just soccer in general. It's like in other sports, is like secondary cards, like. I have a feeling like in football this year, like nobody's really going to care about Joe Burrow or, um, you know, Justin Herbert cards or things like that. But in soccer, and maybe it's more breakers doing this, like everybody still gets excited when they hit like a Holland card or a Mbappe card or, you know, things like that. And to me, I'm like, well, like it really seems like to me, like a lot of the value is in the, um, in the rookies you know it really is so sorry I, I need to sort all this later but I'll get the I'll get the really you know um, really decent uh, like the rookies that everybody's kind of chasing I'll try to keep track of those but it's just a case is a lot of cards is I don't have to you know looks like we got another insert all right and it's gonna be any or Jesus, which that looks a little different, is it? Number? Oh, it is to 199. Nice. Okay. I I was watching the highlights of this kid play, and he's pretty good. And I hope Real Madrid gets him back at some point because they certainly need some offensive threat. Uh, their goal scoring is down. Like they used to score almost three goals a game when Ronaldo was there. Now it's like 1.5. Nice, another Jude Bellingham. Got a pink on the end too. And that's gonna be, oh cool, another Dominic. Very nice pack and a pink is gonna be He Chi Wang. If I'm saying that right, to 175. Okay, very cool. Not a rookie for him, he was a rookie last year, but um, we'll take it. This dropped on tops today, and people were just like, "What? Five hundred dollars a box?" The tops uh, U.S. site though had them for three fifty, and apparently they went out like immediately. But I, I was stupid, and I bought um, I bought some, I bought one on UK and one on Germany because I want to open up um, some boxes with my nephew, and uh, I have two other boxes that I got loose for like $300 a box way back when. I should have just opened up them, but oh well, it is what it is. Sergino Dest, there's another Ramos. And on the back, Trent alexander Arnold. We haven't seen him yet. Okay. I need to watch when I open these. I'm ruining uh, the surprise on the back card, which is the hit card. I wish they'd put it in the third slot, but you know, it is what it is. Got a Joao Felix, Galazzo, non numbered. So, I guess the thing to look out for really is the image variations. I'm assuming they're one per case, and I think there's 10 of them this year. So, I mean, that's quite, uh, 
That's quite a lot. Man, we are getting this team, Marseille, all the time of everything, it seems. Come on, man. We got Giovanni Reina. Second year card, though. Garcia. Been seeing a lot of him. And on the back, another Phil Foden. Okay. Which I think still is going to have value, you know. Um, one, he plays in the EPL. And two, he's English. And three, he's a good player. So, he might not be... Oh, my goodness. He might not be scoring all the goals, but... You know, looks like we got a speckle in this. I haven't seen a Kamavinga in a while. I don't think we've hit any rookie cards of him. Here is, okay. So that's Treore, which I think we've hit several of him as well in like parallels. Need to spread out the love a little bit. But I think with the 100 base, 100 base card set, um, there's Fuente again.